everyone. Say hi, Lennon. Hi. I just want to share you guys or with you guys a little update. I'm going to share a little bit of our Sunday routine. Right now, I'm about to put some chicken in the oven. And then, of course, the kids are going to take a bath. Right now, Sienna's in the bath. And she's perfectly fine. Um, but we usually prepare dinner around 5 to 6. Most of the time, we definitely eat out. Huh, buddy? Um, but that's like mom life and everything. Um, but I'm wearing Bunny right here. She's asleep. Living the dream. Right, Lennon? Yeah, but I just wanted to show you guys a little sneak peek of our Sunday routine this is kind of like unofficial just because i'm trying to find the balance between like um three kids under four well four and under and honestly it's been like quite a struggle mostly a power struggle just because i have to admit that i hate asking for help but honestly i would not be able to do it without any help and luckily David is able to like help me and everything like that. But I just wanted to show you guys a little glimpse of my everyday life now that I'm in on maternity leave just because um, I know it's gonna be a little bit different whenever I go back to work and everything since I'm still on maternity leave. I don't go back to work till February. So as a... Uh, bittersweet it is I'm I want to make sure that I have like a routine down before I go to work and um, tomorrow bunny is gonna be three weeks which I cannot believe just because honestly like time is definitely flying by and everything I just can't believe it she's about to be three weeks but she's doing so good so well if you guys watched my last video of the two-week update we're still breastfeeding so we're about to be three weeks breastfeeding so this is really a huge accomplishment for me just because I didn't think I was going to be able to make it this far of our breastfeeding journey and everything but I think starting at four weeks or five weeks that's when I'm going to start pumping um after I nurse her just to build up a small supply of um breast milk in our freezer I necessarily don't want like an oversupply because that is just too much for me and if anything I could just supplement with formula but I definitely want to um, you know implement um, giving her the bottle too just in case like something happens and somebody wants to give her the bottle while I'm working and such that will work and she won't be strictly you know only relying on breastfeeding so yeah there is a, a small glimpse of um, our Sunday routine and everything and right now I'm about to put um, some chicken in the oven um, I'm gonna make chicken parmesan and mixed veggies um, it's a sheep pan dinner I'll show you here real quick this is it I just use like the McCormick like chicken parmesan little mix thing and then, of course I just put the mix on top of it and there's like frozen mixed veggies so yeah I'm just gonna put that in the oven real quick go let's see here I'm trying not to burn myself yeah and then I'll set the timer see here let's do it old school here let's do 15 minutes there we go and as you see like my house is kind of a hot mess we have dirty dishes and everything we have a thing full of clean dishes but they're clean and of course I just have to organize everything we had to use like the bottom oven um, for cooking the turkey so it's been um, it's been emptied and then I have to stuff this back because like also I use the bottom part as storage just because we are definitely limited on storage as you see my house is kind of cluttered and everything um, but David told me like for Christmas he's gonna replace this door so I really look forward to that because I I just cannot stand that the kids always like pinch their finger on this uh, type of door so I just want to get rid of it and everything.
eating pumpkin pie, huh? Yeah? Did you eat pumpkin pie? Yeah, no. Oh. no. I eat pumpkin pie. You wanna try it? Has she tried it? You wanna bite? You wanna try it? Give her a bite. Here, try it out, chicken. Oh. Try it. No. Chicken. Yeah. The only thing she likes is cheesecake. Then. You like cheesecake? I want. I have it. I want. What? I want. I want pizza. Well, you tried giving you some. like a fail because the kids didn't eat any of the food that I made but what's new Lennon ate chicken nuggets chicken ate crackers and Bunny is over here still kind of snoozing away I have to wake her up because like I want to get her into the habit of her going to sleep at 7 but I kind of failed that today too but I just wanted to show you guys everything that um, we you know pack for Lennon so as you see here like we have our own like disorganized mess and everything like that but I have all his like lunch stuff here like I have his little lunch notes and everything um, my sister like organized everything for me whenever I barely um, gave birth to Logan and everything um, but I just want to show you guys how we pack his little lunch I like adding the little bento little decorations and he decided that he wanted chicken nuggets for tomorrow too so we packed him chicken nuggets little bay bell that has like probiotics because now they make them with probiotics so why not an orange and then of course pumpkin pie and then we also label it for the carbs um to dose him for school and this lunch box is actually from amazon we've had it for over a year and it's very sturdy and everything and then we put his lunch in this actual lunch bag that makes sense yeah but as you see it fits perf perfectly in this lunch bag and then usually i make them a little note so the cool thing about these little notes, I found it off of Amazon, not Amazon, at Target. Um, that it has fun little facts. Yeah, I love you. <laughs> so I just find like little, cute little facts. And then on the back, I uh, write a little note. But yeah, that's what we do every night. We pack his lunch. Sometimes we do it in the morning. Oh, you're done? You want to go to bed? No? Uh, I think your dad would eat it. Yeah, but as you see, these have really fun facts. So right now, we're going to get the kids um, nice and ready for bed. Have a little bit of quiet time so they can wind down. And then, of course, hopefully they do fall asleep because... Honestly, they just don't sleep. Well, Lennon sleeps, but Chicken just doesn't sleep. And we're hoping she sleeps the whole night because we're really tired and everything. The only downside about like um, like Lennon sleeping, um, he wakes up super early. But I mean, I'd rather him sleep a full night than you know anything else. But yeah, this is typically like our nighttime routine. Once I put the kids um, down. Um, usually David and I watch a show or something, but um, it's kind of hard to stay awake lately, um, but we'll see.